we're making one of my favorite desserts. And it actually only has a handful of, of ingredients. So I think it's fair to say a couple ingredient recipe. It's strawberry shortcake. What is better? It's strawberry season right now. I love to go pick them. I mean, aren't those beautiful? So I've taken some sliced strawberries. I've added a quarter cup of sugar. I'm just gonna mix these up. They are delicious. Like, can you even see those? We're gonna set these aside and then we're gonna make this super easy shortcake. Simple, we're gonna leave those. So in here, I've already put some Bisquick. We're gonna use Bisquick, some melted butter, some sugar, and some milk, that's it. So I have two cups of Bisquick and I'm just gonna add another third cup real quick of that Bisquick. Pop that in there. That three tablespoons of butter right in there. I have three tablespoons of sugar. Let's just sprinkle that in. And then I have a half a cup of milk. I'll have these ingredients at the end so you don't have to keep track right now. All right, and now we are just gonna mix. Simple, super simple. But this biscuity shortcake is my favorite. And then to put those yummy strawberries, yes, this will be so good. And you know what? It's looking a little, no, nope, I think we're, sometimes it'll look a little dry, but once you mix it in well, there. We've got a nice, oh yeah. And we'll be ready in just a minute. Look at those strawberries. We'll be ready in just a minute to pop those in the oven. So we've mixed that dough together and I'm gonna use a small scoop. You can make the shortcakes as big as you want. Um, I think it calls for like six teaspoons or tablespoons. So a good size biscuit. Um, but I'm just going to use a scoop and make them smallish. Um, and if you want to have more than one, you can. And I'm just going to scoop them out onto, I lined my cookie sheet with parchment paper. So we'll just make these. And they don't really have to be pretty because we're going to put the pretty strawberries on top. So it doesn't really matter. So I'm literally just scooping the size of shortcake that I like. And then we'll put those yummy strawberries on there. So I've got these on my lined, my parchment paper lined baking sheet. You can see the size that I have. I'm gonna go ahead and put these in the oven. Um, as a side note, if your dough looks a little dry, just add a little more milk. Um, towards the end, mine did look a little bit dry, so I just added a little bit, I mean, not even a quarter cup of milk and mix it up. It's really a no fail recipe uh, for these shortcakes. And besides the strawberries are the star of the show. So it doesn't matter what it looks like. All right, these are going in the oven. I'm gonna bake these at 425 for eight to 10 minutes. Just keep an eye until um, they're golden brown, light golden brown. So let's put these in the oven. It's been about 10 minutes, so we're gonna get them out. Oh yeah, they've browned up nicely. You guys see those? So now we'll construct the perfect strawberry shortcake. I like to break mine open. Look at that. Ooh, it's hot. You could let it cool, but I kind of like it warm with ice cream. So let's take our strawberries. Be sure and get some of that juice down there. like so, and then we'll just finish it off with some vanilla ice cream. You can use whipped cream, but I mean, let's go ahead and do it right. Well, we might have to wait for this to thaw. So we tried it with the scoop and it didn't really work too well. So I'm just gonna go ahead and grab a good bit. I don't like to let it thaw. I like it to go right on top. I don't need a whole lot. So we'll get the perfect bite. It's, it's a big bite, but a little bit of that shortcake, a nice strawberry, some of that juice, and some good vanilla ice cream.
summer this says summer those shortcakes are so good simple easy but delicious go pick strawberries come home and make these super easy shortcakes and enjoy them with your family thanks for watching guys feel free to email me at pennyleecooking at gmail.com and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell